VLA. Uh, it's made by SA Planes and Kit Planes for Africa in South Africa. This aircraft is equipped with a Rotex 912 Turbo from VZ Power. Uh, the max takeoff weight is 700 kilograms with normal factory uh, landing gear and with Alaskan landing gear system it's uh, 750 kilograms. The empty weight of the aircraft is plus minus uh, 380 kilograms. The aircraft is equipped with a EFIS from MGL, which comes standard. Uh, it can come in a nose wheel or tail wheel configuration. We come to the interior of the aeroplane. Uh, it's uh, equipped with an MGL IEFIS Challenger Light. Uh, it's made in South Africa. The EFIS is a full EFIS system. I incorporate the artificial horizon, a GLS, GVOR, 3D moving map terrain uh, and a, a host of other features that too, mu too much to mention. Uh, the aircraft is uh, a 47 kilogram luggage uh, capacity and it's got an external luggage door which makes it a little bit unique in this class of aircraft. Here is a standard uh, bungee type system that I used um, on the faces and tri faces and some of the old Super Cups. Um, there are two brackets welded on the fuselage standard from the factory. Uh, the front bracket that is not used on this aircraft at the moment is for the Alaskan landing gear system from Beringer. Notice that the uh, flaperon system on this aircraft is a little bit different than on, uh, for instance, a Kit Fox or a Eurofox. And we added some leading edge extensions in the front and also the spades on the balancing weights. Uh, this is to reduce the adverse aileron yaw uh, and makes the aircraft much easier to fly and uh, less ball work. During certification of the Safari, we um, quickly realized that without the um, balancing horns in the back, uh, the aircraft will not be certifiable. So we added some aerodynamic horns to uh, get our stick forces right and also to um, take away the pitching moment that the wing produces uh, with the flaps. I've also added the stall fence be in between the surfaces uh, and this also uh, directs the airflow a little bit better so you have more elevator control in landing. The wing is uh, fitted with stall speed vortex generators from stall speed in Australia. Um, they come standard with our kits. Uh, we found that the handling qualities of the aircraft is significantly improved uh, by adding these. It uh, brought the stall speed down by probably five to seven miles an hour, uh, but the biggest benefit was the slow speed handling qualities that improved. This aircraft is from Ivo Propellers in the United States. Um, this is a three-blade medium uh, in-flight adjustable 
and we added the constant speed controller from Flyzone and uh, it's a good combination for this engine.